Hi, this is Jay Grunke from The Balanced Runner. Let's take a look at me running in a gate lab to see the core action in action. Here you go, this is me. Let's look again to see the movement of the pelvis in the transverse plane. You'll see that it rotates to assist the swing leg in coming forward. It's not a huge rotation, but very visible. We'll look at the movement in the frontal plane now, that's uh, side to side. You'll see that the hip rises at foot strike to help absorb impact and then pushes down to help uh, create the toe off. Movement in the sagittal plane, you'll see that um, as I move towards toe off, the pelvis tilts forward on that side with the front of the hip going down and the back going up. In the upper body movement, now um, you'll see that the shoulders rotate so it's not just the arm moving the chest as well. And so now let's take a look at the whole core action together and in the context of a spring. So you can see how the rotation of the shoulders plus the action of the pelvis lengthens the side that's towing off each time and helps drive running.